After a nearly three-year hiatus due to the COVID-19 pandemic, 90% of carnival bands are expected to hit the streets for a road march in just a few weeks. Members of the carnival community detailing plans for a series of carnival events that will all play out during survival weekend, and it's being described as three days of non-stop partying that will all take place between May 20th to May 22nd. One of the largest events will be the May 21st road march that will include a two-mile route from Arawak Key to Goodman's Bay and back. President of the Bahamas Carnival Band Owners Association, Raphael Dean. We know that it's a short amount of time um, because Carnival is basically deemed to try to bring in international funding you know, to the country, but this specific road parade will um, just basically be, um, it'll be about 90% bohemian participation um, to get the product started. We will use this as a launch for the big carnival that will be back, God's willing, um, next year. A letter addressed to Dean and dated April 27, 2022, revealed the Ministry of Health and Wellness granted permission for the road march. The letter, which was obtained by the Nassau Guardian, notes that the event is permitted to have up to 500 people. But Dean says they expect they will get MOH approval for that number to be doubled. The only issue with that number was it was a typo and it will be corrected. And we followed up with the Ministry of Health and a new letter will be issued possibly this week. It'll be a maximum probably of 1,000 to 1,200 persons. Bahamas Carnival was last held in 2019. A bubble carnival event was held in November. It was the first carnival-like event to be held since the COVID-19 pandemic started in March 2020. As for the other events slated for Survival Weekend, which is being organized by Alpha Sounds Promotions, they will also include a mega concert and beach fest. Alpha Sounds Promotion CEO Trevor Davis. What happened this year is because, again, as Ross stated, because I was going to do Survival Weekend, with or without anything else happening, I think they see it fitting to say use this opportunity to springboard and to showcase and to let the world know that Bahamas Carnival is back and it's going to be back next year, bigger and better. Because reporting for Guardian News Network, I'm Jasmine Brown.